my background is in, in architecture before I sort of got into uh, advertising. And one of the things as, as architects we do is, is create experiences. Um, and I think that really translates into advertising. And so I started to think about really how our, our daily routine could become like a game. And if we think about our city uh, as, as a chessboard and we become the chess piece, then how there could be moments of interaction in that daily game and in that routine. And so through that, um, basically, Gold Run was born. Um, so, and you can see that the play is sort of a brand new reality. It's a play, obviously, on, on brands and, and crafting uh, a new reality around us. And so essentially, Gold Run is a, a mobile platform that brings together augmented reality, virtual goods, and GPS to create a hybridized new media buy that really connects brands and consumers in the mobile space. And for those of you who aren't familiar with augmented reality, it's basically allows us to layer a digital, um, any kind of digital object onto the real world. Um, the most basic form that people are aware of is, is when you're watching a football, mat, football game and, a, and you see the line on the field. That's a form of augmented reality. Um, and, you know, and we're used to having these very visually driven interactive um, experiences online, on the web. And so I really thought, well, why can't we take those and bring that into the offline world? And that's Gold Run. Um, so if we start to think about, again, um, we're used to sort of e-commerce uh, online, but what happens when we sort of translate that offline and you have virtual commerce or what we're calling v-commerce? Um, and so we've sort of tried to build these bridges between the digital and the physical. So it's, it's very much about context. I'm going to show a quick film. And um, this was a, a campaign done with, uh, with YNR and Airwalk. This is an Airwalk store. And so is this. They are the world's first invisible pop-up stores. Stores that can be set up anywhere at any time. Simply by using smartphones, geolocation, and augmented reality. We created them for the limited edition relaunch of the Airwalk Gym, a sneaker originally made for kids who hang out in skate parks or on the beach instead of going to gym class. So that's where we set up the stores. Because the marketing budget was small, we relied on bloggers to get the word out. And on November 6, 2010, the stores went live for one day. To get the gym, people had to be in the right location, so they downloaded the Gold Run app, found the store, found the shoe, and bought it. It got a lot of buzz. Airwalk got $5 million worth of earned media, and their e-store had its busiest weekend ever. Tell me what augmented reality shopping is and why that's going to be a big deal this year. Augmented reality is pretty rad. For example, in New York City, we've got an invisible store where if you're in the right location and you put your phone up, you can see a whole Airwalk store. An exclusive product sold to an exclusive audience for an entirely new retail experience. They're a cool style and, and I'm glad they're back and uh, I'm gonna get a pair today. The Invisible Pop-Up Store. Watch out for the next one invisibly appearing near you. So, um, you know, obviously why mobile? The reason why mobile is because in the last quarter, smartphone sales surpassed PC sales for the first time. So obviously brands, ad agencies need to be in the mobile space and so, the idea here is, is um, creating a platform, which we're now all sort of used to with Facebook and Twitter and whatnot, which is the idea of uh, an existing tool set that brands and ad agencies can use um, and use quickly and cost efficiently to sort of bring their existing campaigns into the mobile space. Um, this is just another example I wanted to walk through with, um, with uh, <laughs> Brooklyn Decker. This is Andy Roddick's wife. And uh, you'll see, I'm just going to sort of talk over this um, clip, but this is a done for Esquire. And um, we basically took Brooklyn Download Decker was the, the gold if you could turn it's it down, I'll, I'll just talk over it. If we, um, Brooklyn Decker was the uh, cover model of the, of the February issue. 
And we thought, okay, well, Airwalk had chosen to use Gold Run as a way to actually sell limited edition product. But Esquire wanted to take traditional media, print media, and bring it into the mobile space. So we took Brooklyn Decker, turned her into an augmented reality object, and actually GPS linked her to 720 Barnes and Nobles across the country. So all of a sudden, when you were in a Barnes and Noble, you could actually, through, through Gold Run, you could take a photo with her. So we were, in that case, using it um, as a way to create a virtual photo booth. Um, and so people all over could suddenly take take photos with her and interact with the Esquire brand. So it was a very different way um, than Airwalk chose to do it. So there's obviously promotional plays and actual um, sort of uh, revenue plays with selling product. And these are just showing some of the, the stills from the app. Um, we're able to use sort of 2D and 3D objects, still or animation. Um, so sort of what this all amounts to is, is really, we just talked about some of these, but extend, expanding a, a brand's presence and reach and inviting uh, fans and consumers to act with the brand in a whole new level, as we're seeing, and um, creating an experience that aligns with people's lifestyles. So this is very much about context. It's about um, sort of where you're going throughout your day, and we're able to, um, through our content management system, GPS any, any uh, physical area so we can create different hot zones. So, uh, you know, a sports stadium or a mall or a retail store could all become hot zones. You can create a treasure hunt um, or, you know, drive traffic to retail. Um, and then these are just to end on a few photos of campaigns. This was with Mark Echo, uh, Fight the Paddle campaign that he did. So we're using the augmented reality object. Literally, it's just a simple virtual sticker. You know, so to, to participate in the campaign, you're sort of taking a sticker where, wherever you are, a photo wherever you are, and posting those to Facebook. In the middle, that's that alien uh, film, Paul. So Paul was uh, walking around in South by Southwest. Um, literally, you know, we GPS linked that 3D character uh, to the to, to South by Southwest, so through our app you could see him take photos, um, and this was a, also virtual uh, stencils. And then here, this was a campaign with H&M where we were taking their clothing and creating virtual fitting rooms, um, the two photos on either side, so you can actually virtually try on the clothing. And then by doing so and taking a photo, you got a discount, a 10% uh, coupon redeemable for anything in their store. Um, so thanks so much. That's Gold Run.